Hey, what is up again, everyone? It's no movement. Um, I'm sorry I haven't been making videos lately. I've been having a lot of problems. Um, so on screen right now, you see me doing some Slayer. You got that two times Slayer going on right now. But if you notice, my mic is really staticky, and you got that buzzing sound in the background and shit. So I'm about to get rid of that when I get a new mic in a few days. So when that happens, I should be able to start uh the Road to Max series with my friend Soraxta, who is doing or was doing Slayer with me. Here he is right here. We're going to be doing Race to Max Cape. We're going to see who can get there first. We're both about equally the same. I'm about 10 levels higher than him. So I guess you can call this kind of a, a Slayer vlog in a way, but I don't know. It's not really going to be that long. I just want to explain that the reason I haven't been doing videos is because my mic is pretty fucking bad right now. But I should, like I said, I should have that fixed in a few days. Um, oh, This 2 times Slayer XP is actually fucking really good. I mean, I've gotten 318k in like 2 hours, so it, it's pretty fucking fast. And I'm actually doing a a duo task right now with my friend uh Uber Baked or Chris and he's pretty cool too. He should be in some videos eventually. Um but yeah I just wanted to make this video to update you guys what's going on. Um I actually didn't want to make any videos until I got my partnership or uh, my partnership went through because I did get a partnership with um Prolax through RPM. So that should be up in probably about one or two days, maybe even tomorrow, which would probably be the best option. Really wasn't expecting it to take about ten days to go through. But yeah, pretty cool I got that. RPM, Prolax, really good networks. Really uh, recommend you guys go and check them out if you want to get a partnership. It's about 250 views a day for Prolax, so it's it's pretty reasonable. Um, But yeah, I uh, also want to talk about one of the other reasons, other than my, uh, my headset being fucked up and me not being able to record in good quality, is I actually have a pretty fucking nasty story to tell you guys if you want to hear it. Um... If you don't, this would probably be the best time to not listen and to end the video. So, uh, if you guys want to end it here, I'll talk to you next time later, uh, or else you can listen to the story. So, um, a few days ago, I actually got a um, fucking pimple like right by the bottom of my lip, and you know I popped that bitch like I usually do to all the fucking other ones that come out of nowhere for no fucking reason. But this one was different, you know. I ended up fucking waking up, and when I woke up, my lip was more swollen than a black woman's ass. So that shit was fucking huge. I mean, it wasn't my whole bottom lip, it was the, the bottom right side where I popped that bitch. And at first I thought, you know, it's just because I squeezed the living shit out of it. Because you guys know it's hard to pop a fucking pimple that's close to your lip. So, when that shit was swollen, I freaked the fuck out. I didn't know what to do. So, um, I asked my mom and she said, you know, just fucking go look on the internet. So I looked on the internet and uh, I just basically found shit saying, don't pop a pimple by your lip or you get a fucking swollen lip. So I'm like, alright, shit will go down in a little bit. So... Woke up the next day, and I had a fucking huge-ass fucking ugly-looking bitch just chilling on my lip. And I was like, what the fuck is this shit? So I put, like, um, because I didn't want to pop it because I knew what fucking happened the last time I tried to. So I put a bunch of, like, chapstick and shit over it. And uh, a few hours later, I felt something. This is going to get pretty nasty, guys. So like I said, you might need to get the fuck out if you don't want to hear this. So basically, I felt something oozing down my lips, so I was like, what the fuck is this shit? So I go in the mirror and I look and, like, th it's like a fucking just hole in my lip. I had no idea what the fuck it was. I was freaking out, so I'm like, alright, I'm just gonna squeeze this bitch. So I started squeezing it, and then I had, like, fucking yellow pus just coming out of my lip. And, ugh, it was fucking nasty. Like, there was so much, too. And by this point, I was like, alright, my lip's fucking infected, and I'm going to the doctor, so... I went to the doctor, and... Uh, he said that it and it was actually a boil or a skin abscess, so we'll just call it a boil because that sounds a lot fucking nastier and and I think we're going it up down the fucking nasty trail right now, so we might as well. So I have a fucking boil on my lip. Shit's not fucking fun. When I went in there, I was like, my mom said, "Oh, you probably just have to get some antibiotics, take it for a couple of weeks, and you know you'll fucking that shit'll be gone." Uh, so I'm on antibiotics right now. Hopefully it'll go away soon. Um, actually, like, when I was in there, the fucking doctor, he said, we might have to cut part of your lip open to try to drain it out. I was like, no. Are you fucking kidding me? They wanted to fucking give me a shot in my lip and cut that bitch open and squeeze that shit out. I was like, fuck no. So, they actually ended up not having to do that because, like, the pus in my lip was hard and they couldn't squeeze anything out even if they did cut it. So, they basically just said go on antibiotics and that's what I'm doing right now. Um... The bad thing is, is that even though the antibiotics, you know, they they just make it so, like, no more bacteria can form. It doesn't take away the stuff that's already there. So, I fucking, the opening that was in my lip, it fucking scabbed up and, like, like is almost healed. So, the f I had to fucking, like, 
uh, two hours ago, I had to use a needle and poke the shit out of it for like an hour until it opened up so I could squeeze more shit out. So I I literally sat there for an hour just, just fucking going hard on my lip with a needle. Like it was the fucking worst pain ever and I knew I had to get it open or they'd end up having to cut it open in the emergency room. So it hasn't been fucking fun lately. That's what I've been going through. Probably the main reason I haven't been doing videos. Um, if you guys have survived through this long with my fucking terrible headset and my fucked up story, thank you guys, really appreciate it, but, um, yeah, other than that, I'm just waiting for my fucking lip to heal, hopefully the antibiotics work, so I don't end up having to go to the emergency room, um, yeah, I should have my new headset in two days, and we can start the road to Max Cape, uh, so I hope you guys, you know, enjoyed this video, this is how my commentaries will be, not like my fucking last video where the 2400 total level, that that was just fucking like four in the morning. I couldn't talk loud because my brother was sleeping, so uh, I really couldn't do shit. So I was just talking really low, and I felt like one of those fucking ten-year-old commentators who just, who just didn't know what the fuck he was doing. First video ever, that kind of shit. So, and also, if you guys don't like the cussing as much, tell me. I mean, I I generally cuss a lot in real life, so I'm kind of used to it. And I just got a fucking dragon dagger, laughed my ass off. I can't believe I just didn't laugh my ass off. But yeah, anyways, I'll talk to you guys in probably a few days when I get my new headset and I've fixed my fucking fucked up lip so yeah I'll talk to you guys later thanks for listening to this I hope you enjoyed it and uh, subscribe for more content peace